Hi guys, we're Ghostbusters Frozen Empire. Now before I do, look, subscribe, click the bell for his album. So this is a supernatural comedy film. It was directed by Gil Keenan. It is a sequel to Ghostbusters Afterlife and the fifth film in the Ghostbusters franchise. It stars Paul Rudd, Carrie Coon, Finn Wolfhard, McKenna Grace, and Tess O'Connor, a lone Kim Prize in Ross Afterlife, alongside Bill Murray, Dan Aykroyd, Annie Hudson, Annie Potts, and William Atherton, reprising their roles from the earlier films, and Kumail Nanjiani, Peyton Oswald, Emily Allen Lind, and James Akistar, who also joined the cast. And so it's said two years after the events of Afterlife, the veteran Ghostbusters must join forces with their new recru recruits to save the world in New York City from a powerful, death chilling adversary who seeks to build a spectral army. So, um, I like Ghostbusters, I like Ghostbusters, Ghostbusters 2, uh, the 2016 one I think is fine, and then Afterlife I really liked, and when they also doing a sequel, I was so, I was looking forward to this. And, um, yeah, this one, and, uh, yeah, um, I love the trailers, so, um, I watched the cinemas today, um, I really enjoyed it, I really think it, this was good, and, um, yeah, I really, this was directed by Gil Keenan, um, if you don't know Gil Keenan, he directed, um, uh, The Monster House, um, yeah, he directed, uh, Poltergeist House 15, Monster House, um, a, a boy called Christmas, and um, yeah, Jason Reitman, um, who was the son of even Reitman, he directed um, Afterlife. He's a producer on this one, and a writer, and um, and I think this it was good. I thought the story was interesting. Um, I liked all the characters who come back from um, Afterlife, the new ones, and also the OG on Bill Murray, Dan Aykroyd, Ernie Hudson, Ernie Potts, and William. After ten reprise off from the first movie, and um, yeah, I was really looking forward. This is one of my most anticipated movies this year, and I remember the red the um, run to my score. Okay, it was like forty four percent, but I was gonna watch the movie anyway, and I thought it was great. Um, it was emotional. I really loved the action in it. I loved the visuals. Um, the music was good. Um, who did the music? Dara Murray Netti, and um, yeah, I really I had a good time with it. Um. I'll give it a 7 out of 10. I really thought it was good. And, um, yeah, it was entertaining. Um, I think I, I might, in, I think I enjoyed Afterlife a bit more, but I think this is a fun movie. I still think the first Ghostbusters is probably the best, but it was really good. I really enjoyed it. Um, I thought the story was interesting, and I enjoyed it. So, what you should watch this movie. Don't listen to the critics. Um, it's a really good movie. So, yeah, give it, I give it a 7 out of 10. Guys, I'm watch my videos for my next one, but oh, yeah, there also is a post-credits. I'm not gonna spoil it for you, but yeah. So I'll see my next one. Bye.